Welcome back to H3 Weapon Deep Dive. Got a fun... I like this one. It's it's cool for some reason. It's the Model 38 submachine gun chambered in 9x19. We got three little magazines to choose from. You got a 10, a 20, and a 30 round stick magazine. Goes in the bottom like that. It's got a really long barrel. It's a very long sub submachine gun. But uh, it's fun. I don't know. I just like it. Uh, it fires kind of open bolt there, so you can see. And screw it. Let's check it out. Let's take a look at the controls on the Model 38. What do we got here? Well, we've got our 30-round magazine. I'm just going to use that one. We've got left on the trackpad is going to change our selector switch between safe and full auto. Got our bolt on the right-hand side. Goes way back. Stays open in the open bolt position. Fires like so. There you go. Down on the trackpad will not release the magazine. You gotta pull it out yourself manually and it will not stay open on empty. So you gotta operate the bolt each time. Also comes with the wiggly bit. There's a wiggly bit over there. Uh, I think that's the only wiggly bit. Yep, there's one wiggly bit. See what attachments will fit on this old guy well no rails no lasers no red dots how about a foregrip for the foregrip no none of that let's see it'll go on the barrel muzzle brake no and in fact it looks like there's already some kind of compensator on there i wonder if that affects the recoil we will find out momentarily but unfortunately it means we can't put anything on the end of this barrel no barrel extensions no suppressors no rail adapters, nothing. How about a spatula? Not, not even a spatula. Uh, it's already got a stock, so we don't need another stock. So, no attachments. Let's check out the sights. What do we got here? Well, we've got adjustable sights from 100 to 500 meters in 100 meter increments, zeroed at 100. Yeah, it seems to fire pretty flat right here. So that's okay. Uh, I like these sights pretty good. Got a big chunky front post. Easy to find. Nice cutout on the rear notch. Yeah, these will do pretty good for iron sights of the period. Nice. Let's do our recoil test. 30 rounds of 9x19 full auto. Here we go. Well... It's quite a good result. 8.47 with nothing on the barrel. I'm pretty sure that this is acting as a compensator because that is a good result with nothing on the barrel. Look at that. And most of those were right in the 8 ring. They didn't start drifting off into the 7 and 6 until the very end of that magazine. That long 30 round magazine. There you have it. The Model 38. Big Woodstock SMG. But I like it. And it looks like it's got a compensator built in. So you don't have to worry about that. And good iron sights. Till next time, I will see you. Nine two seven. Ooh.